today's edition of Alumni Spotlight. I'm here today with Michael, who graduated from SOS HEIC as recently as 2019. It's a pleasure to have you here, Michael. It's a pleasure to be here too. Okay, thank you very much for coming to speak to our students today. And now we want the alumni and the rest of the student community to hear more about you, where you're from, what you're doing now. So first of all, what is your full name? Uh, my name is Michael Mugisha. Okay, and you're from? I'm from Uganda, and currently I'm at Ashesi University doing business administration. And it's, 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 it's almost like being back home. Yeah, wonderful. So, I mean, first of all, you came from Uganda to Ghana for AGIC, but you decided to stay on. What made you decide to stay on? Yeah, I, I think, uh, first of all, it was part of my, it was my course. Yeah. Uh, I actually offered my full course. And uh, the fact that I looked at also other factors like um, the class size, the, the resources and the opportunities, and I guess it was just the right fit. So it motivated me to come to Ghana. And the fact that I was already in Ghana and I was used to the culture, yeah. so it was much more easier to integrate and transition very well at university. It was, it was I think it's the perfect. Yeah, and the food, did, did the Ghanaian food convince you at all or not <laughs> so much? <laughs> uh, you know, like, because now I, I had been in Ghana for four years, yeah. I was already used to the food. That's right. Yeah, yeah. so yeah. now. Going back to Ashesi, it's the same food. Yeah. So nothing really changed in terms yeah. of food. Um, yeah, the accent, exactly. uh, understanding the Ghanaian accent in class, I would just flow with it, yeah. even understand part of the tree. Uh, wow, so, so you speak some tree? I know, <laughs> I can understand yeah, I'm some I'm not going to test you. I'm oh, sure. <laughs> anyway, so at HEIC, what was it like for you? What was the best part of SOS for you? Uh, the best part for me was... Um, when I won Orita of the Year. Oh, wow! <laughs> that was a round of applause. Fantastic. Wow. Yeah, because uh, I tried it for uh, three years. Yeah. And then the first year, I, I wasn't recognized. Yeah. I failed. But then I think that one pushed me to work harder. Yeah. And then I came in the second year, and I was second. Yeah. And then again, I moved on until my final year, I got to be the wow. Orita of the Year. What hostel were you in over here when you were at AGIC? Uh, it was in Mano. Mano, okay. And how was it for you? How was hostel like? What was your best? Well, you said the best part for you was um, winning um, of the year. What were some of the challenging aspects of AGIC for you? Um, the curriculum. Okay. Yes, I think that was the most challenging part. Get transitioning from my Ugandan uh, local cur curriculum to now an international IP curriculum, learning new things uh, for subjects, especially for subjects like literature. I was doing a totally different kind of literature. And then when I came to Ghana, everything changed. So I, I really had a hard time in my literature class because I remember I, I bombed for the first for the first semester trying to get the concept, how to analyze and poems and stories. But then uh, with practice I became better and then it was good to overcome the well, Michael, thank you very much for making time to speak to us today. Thank you for visiting campus, and we want to see more and more of you. Sure. And all the best at the share. Thank you.